All right, chat. I am back. Sorry about that. Kind of uh, <laughs> the Qdoba hit me quick. I'm gonna leave it at that. <laughs> Anyways, uh, go ahead and jump back into this. Uh, right, so I'm still missing five points before I get the next upgrade. Um, let's see. It's actually not far, so I'm gonna fast travel over there. And I'm going to see if we can get these five points to upgrade this one. Why not? Plus, it's inside an Albion area. See? Do they notice you changing out? Okay. They don't. I think I'm gonna switch back to uh, looking at this. Let's see, team, this, that. Also, I don't know who it was, but I, I must have recruited somebody that has a uh, Desert Eagle, because this guy used to have the P9, but now he has a uh, Desert Eagle as an option. Unless if maybe it's another Albion character. I'm not sure, I didn't actually go over that i had something else too it was i think it was like my professional spy or something where they had the option of using a uh yeah the spy thing somebody else had like multiple app option um where are they this guy yeah this guy professional hitman he has the option of using all of these like the pistol, Desert Eagle, uh, AK, and the P9. I thought it was pretty crazy. But he's like the only one. He has a Desert Eagle. So she can use a P9 as well. But yeah. So, I don't know. I don't know where that really came from, but I guess that's kind of cool. Anyways, uh, yeah, I wanted to switch back to the cloak here. That way we have that. And then let's go inside here and try to get these this point. Um, before we do that, let's scout it out a little bit. How was your food? Dude, it was, it was good. Um... <laughs> That's pretty much all I got on that, but it was good. Uh, classic like Chipotle, or not Chipotle, um, whatever it's called. Is walking okay? Um, Udoba. It was good though. I uh, enjoyed it for sure. Almost getting spotted. What's 
next. Give it up. Getting you nowhere. They fucked off. We better check back with the others. All right, we made it. Oof. Catch. All that spider bot. And hack it. So these ones you can't um you can't do takedowns and stuff. Here we go. That's all I came for. <laughs> Off to bed, I have to go. Uh have a good rest of your stream. Alright, bed. Hey, thank you for stopping by, man, as always. Uh always a good time chatting. And uh have a good remainder of your day, man. pick up this there's somebody somebody's like enemy up ahead Sweet, now we can hijack the CT drone. What's that? Suspect of operative Catherine Moran. Detsec helped their client satisfy a vendetta. Therapist. Okay. 60. If we get 60, then we can have the drone fight for us. I'm gonna close this out. Otherwise, it will keep doing that. Okay. So now. Um. What's this mission? Go run this. Access 404 CTOS hub down here. Located the CTOS hub. If you were listening to this, it means you want to learn more about 404. Know what we know. Do what we do. Make your way to the walkie talkie club. It's no big secret that the club is a front for Clan oh. Kelly, but the place has other secrets too. More will be revealed there. The hub just dumped a massive load of data into your optic. How forward. Now we're starting to run into like former su uh, subjects and things like that. All right, so to the walkie talkie club, we were there earlier today. I might even switch characters as well because this area didn't require anything, but 
Uh, let me actually check. Is there a button that you can press or a key that'll open up your team right away? Menu, scan, hack, lock on, quick hack, map, team menu, key. Okay. Got it. Cool. Um, let's give this guy, the one of our new people, a try. This one right here. Unlimited range, fast downloads, and I uh, extra Ellie Vendetta uh, damage. Or Kelly, Clan Kelly damage. I haven't used this person at all yet. Another brave soul for our ranks. Welcome aboard. Damn right. Man's ready to tear it up. Fucking excellent. I hate that voice. I'm about to change it. Just because of that. I have another guy that's like cocky like that too. And it's so annoying to me. Oh. <laughs> we'll see. Damn, dude. You hit me. By now, you must have reached 20 Fenchurch Street. The Walkie Talkie Club is located at the top of the building. Lift access only. All right, I'll try to see what this is. Uh, what is uh, you have arrived words are the for this mission? Club, where those with more money than sense come to lose both. The Walkie Talkie Club is frequented by all manner of crooked elites, and the owners, Clan Kelly, have an AI in place to collect blackmail material. Find that AI, and let's see for ourselves what these corrupt scumbags have to hide. Forget how we got in there the first time. Oh yeah, we used the spire bot. Music's pretty cool in here. So it'd be like one of those fun places to go to, like with your friends when the multiplayer releases. Persevered, and now we have nothing. The AI <laughs> is not actually here, just a relay sending the club's data off site. I'll find where it's all going, and you find a way out of this loud, obnoxious sweat hole. Deal? Deal. All right, let's get out of here. I we'll have a drink on our way out. <laughs> there we go. Then Carter Auto Drive will also uh, yeah technology grand. I've done some digging and it looks like the facial recognition AI was created by Broker. Yo, what's going on, Ice Flame? Broker Tech. How you doing? They're one of the biggest software companies on the planet. Always keep their noses clean mm. too. If they're buying blackmail material from the Kellys, that's big news. Everything the AI is collecting here is being sent directly to Broker Tech HQ. We have to go there to get the data. Race the data at the broker tech. Oh wow. Like perfect area. Best travel there. Recruit a spy to use their silenced MP or P9 and unique agency toys, a spy watch. Alright. So this might actually work out. 
because this guy can hack from anywhere. I'm very bad. How about you? I'm doing pretty good, but sorry to hear you're not doing great, man. We have an opportunity to release it all publicly. I believe that's exactly what our 404 friend has in mind. Ah, uh, cool. I'm all over it. Do they have a spider bot? They do have a spider bot. Hold up. Where is it? Trying to see I can if I can get into the room that has their spider bot falling machine. There it is. It would be right in the corner. I don't know if I'm even going to need to do this, but playing WoW today. Nah, not really. Um, I think I'm honestly going to be taking a break from WoW for a bit now since uh, I did see that they they put out the release date. Um, it looks like that the game's going to be coming out in uh, what? March or no, not March. I don't know where March came from. Uh, the November 23rd, something like that. <laughs> I have no idea where March came from. Sorry, I'm uh, bad at multitasking during some of these more intense missions. <laughs> but right now, I'm honestly just chilling, just to, I don't know, figure out what I want to do. You know what I could do? Is there any, do they have any drones in there? I don't think so. Let's see. I can send this drone in, hopefully to uh, grab that maybe. Oh, hijack that, don't mind me. I'm trying to get in. Wait, where is the spider bot? Spider bot. Spider bot. There it is. Call it quick. Back it. Go, 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 go. Oh, wow. That worked out perfectly for that, at least. I'm completely outside of this area, too, right now. There it is. I have all the blackmail data and dear God, people are disgusting. I wonder how this family values politician will appreciate his SM sessions on public display. Oh well, let's find out. Blackmail data is hereby leaked. Oh, it's true. Escape the area. Nice. Nice. We got crypto. Oh, I like that number. I'd say it's a thankless job, but someone just sent us a video link named thank you mp4. So at least it's a one <laughs> thank job. Let's see it. You have completed your first contract with 404, the dark web's first peer-to-peer -peer hacktivist network. I am in the network. I give the contracts. That's all you need to know about me. I'm nobody. I'm now. I'm also connected to your optic now, so... Let's see who you are. Hold on. Hmm. 
Are you a dead sec? Oh, this is fucking mint, this. <laughs> yeah. That's more like it. Fortune's smiling on us today, dead sec. The world is fucked. And we can help each other set things right. I'm at Somerset House, staking out contracts. Come and find me. Let's talk. Leaders. She seems friendly. What's her name, Bagley? I've run Nout's name and face through the usual databases and turned up nothing. Oh, Nout. <laughs> right, just got that. She seems cool and all, but is meeting her a good idea? She could backstab us at the drop of a hat. Worth the risk, in my opinion. She seems like a real dead sec fan, and I'd certainly rather have her as a friend than an enemy. If she isn't with Zero Day, she might know who is. And if she is with Zero Day, it's probably a trap. What kind of game Either is way, this? We'll new information. This is... Let's roll. Sorry. So basically, you're... Uh, this is an open world game. Watch Dogs is more like a ha hacking, like GTA style uh, game. But the cool thing in this one you. is you can literally recruit any person. Every single thing that person that you see here, every person that, uh, every person has a schedule. You can recruit them, you can play as them. So like this girl, I could uh, recruit her. If I did a mission for her, these two guys are hanging out with each other until 3 a.m. Um, she is a professional shopper. Like every single person that you see, you can play as, and basically they all have different skills. Some are spies, some are, uh, they have cool abilities for other things. It's really like the variety is it's crazy up there. Um, really neat actually. But right now we're running like uh, hacking missions and stuff. Uh, trying to rebuild this uh, dead sec, which is the hacktivist group, and then also take down uh, this private military company that's very uh, corrupt and evil, pretty much. That's a, uh, a quick rundown of the game. <laughs> and it's a lot of fun, because you can literally do like almost anything, which is insane. Ready for more police work? I was able to intercept a Clan Kelly laptop. It's full of Clan Kelly accounting data. Substantial amounts have been diverted to an unrelated account. Oh, sick. Someone's stealing from the Kellys. How do we find this thief? You may be right. I believe Bagley has a lead. Good luck. Good luck. All right, so now we we also have a meeting here. <laughs> I think it selects random characters Here's for the meeting. Here's what we know about Nigel Cass. He's rolling out something called Project Themis. The lack of information on its own is worrisome. But what little we do know is Cass wishes to remove the human element from law enforcement. We also know he's partnered with Titus, which is never good. Titus does other work with Albion. Nasty shit like autonomous weapons, human targeting algorithms. So Titus is our best lead to fill in the blanks on the secret project, but their security is notoriously difficult to crack. So Hamish has proposed an intriguing solution. Albion's been working on a new micro drone, something my contact told me about. That shit's not even in production yet, but if we get the plans, we can manufacture our own. To get around Titus security? Exactly, exactly. They're weird as fuck supposed to do maintenance on Albion's other drones, but the smallness of them means they can slip into places nothing else can. Well, there we have it. Our next hmm. step is to infiltrate the Albion drone manufacturing lab and get our hands on schematics. And then you lot will have a fun little gadget to break in the Titus. Love it. I'll shoot you the location. Be careful. Albion doesn't like to share his toys. Right. There's one other computer connected to the same network. It's at the old canal warehouse. Nice. How much money do we have? 18. Not bad, not bad. <laughs> Getting up there with money finally. All right, back out here. 
Sprinting and climbing do not cancel active AR. Use this to your advantage when sneaking through restricted areas. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what missions we got now. Uh, we have a Caitlyn request. We have this or a four not found. I'm going to do this one because it gives you that 20 uh, points. Question is, do I wait to have 60 or... I'm going to wait to have 30 so that way I can hij 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 hijack turrets. <laughs> and then, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to wait for that. What's that? All right, so fast travel up here. What's up this Albion? OK, cool. So this next area is an Albion area, but Uh, okay, nice. Now there's some tech points in there as well. You're in. Now find the thing. Alright, so it looks like it's up above, and I think it's a physical... Physical one will need a hack, so let's see if we can do this. Nice spider bot. We automated London's black cat. We brought Bagley to your office. But our latest endeavor is something entirely new. Technology and humanity, two sides of the same coin. That is the heart of daybreak. A chance to leave the troubles of the world behind. Things may seem bleak now, but well, the steps. Ah, uh, okay. Cool. An ambition of love and prosperity. Draw there might be a way to get down there. Unleash the full potential of your mind. One simple clean procedure, and you could be free forever. Sign up for our weakness today and join us in the world of tomorrow. Daybreak is the future. Video access. Uh, now. Damn. Hey, you made it. Yo, we, we could do this another time if. What? Oh, him. Yeah. He thought I was trespassing. I set him straight. Right. Now, about that message I sent you. I might have been a little, uh, <laughs> Real close. little excited. Oh, shut up! All right, have a go on Iceland. A massive contract. Thanks for stopping by. The plebs you use 404. This contract is different. Dangerous. Who is it? I will tell you. But first, I have to trust you. And you have to trust me, you know? So, I'm going to send you another 404 contract. Let's just get to know each other a little better. Look, I don't know you. What's your agenda? What makes your target so bad? Oh, there you go. Asking the right questions. Trust me, I do my research. I know every contract inside out and they're all part of the problem. London, the world, will be much better off with our help. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to move this twat before he gets his strength back. Laters. She's like the, uh, seems like the cousin of, um, Not a name? trap. Sounds like we have a potential partnership with this mean, aggressive mystery woman. Give it a think and we'll discuss once you're out of Somerset House. Let me see if I can get that, that tech point. What do I do? Broker Tech is led to the world. Zero day? No. I don't buy it. Oh, so the woman will This place is so loud. We'll gain more from working with her. If you decide to become gig economy activists, then I'll support you. Because I literally have no choice. A chance to leave the troubles of the world. There it is. 
Nice. Go to Nexus Tower. Okay, so it's right there. Fast travel to the London Bridge. Still drawing a strong and offensive tool. Uh, something, something, something missed it. <laughs> Right, Your man's one. live on the scene. Well done. Let me tell that. you about your contract. Your man's live the on the tower scene. The quantum computer used by Albion. <laughs> it simulates civilian response to large-scale events. Mass arrests, deportations, bombings. Oh, fuck me. Albion's calculating how much shit they can pull without starting a riot. Chase drone? It's a minging piece of work. Destro Is there a way to hack chase drones? Uh, you can, uh... Oh, wait. Base drones can be hijacked. All right. Uh... I'll take it. Because it'll be useful right now. By the quantum computer. That's the contract. Oh my god! <laughs> I like in the, uh, this game. Personally, I think it's a lot of fun. Uh, it's definitely a change in pace, or like depending on how you take uh, take on missions and everything. But I, I've been loving it so far. I love the the team building and some of the characters that they give you access to or that you can find. I think a lot of it's uh, really neat. It's different, you know? Like, it's something that we haven't really... Oh, Jesus. A turret, man. I think he's taking me right down. Um, but yeah, I've, I've been loving it so far. The story is decent, too. I mean, like, it depends on the voice actor. Some of the voice actors are a little weird or, uh, like, it just kind of doesn't really fit perfectly but overall like um it's not bad it's just well some of the voice actors are kind of bad but <laughs> you just have to kind of find a person that fits the setting it's a very serious game for the most part too besides like uh uh some jokes that the ai makes Yo, what's going on, living legend? Hello, hello. How art thou? Hmm. I really wish you could like, like the, the guards had like cameras on them. So you could uh, hack them like that. I think that would be really cool. Let's try to get in there. Damn, how do we disable that? Bagley is awesome. Yeah, he is. He really is. I think the only way of doing this is if you do that. I don't see any way of turning this off and the turrets will go off or whatever. Sweeping the area near the 
alarm. Drone, initiate search protocol. Nothing. Nothing? Oh well. Back to patrols. Almost got it. Boom. You're a natural. Next step is to wait for now to get back to us. But don't wait here. That would be a shit idea. <laughs> True say. Dead good. Glad to establish a foundation of trust. I'm ready to show you the contract I'm investigating. Go to the GBB. You shouldn't have any trouble finding her. But don't stay there. That would be a shit idea. <laughs> I love that. Let's see if I can. I don't know if this is going to work, but. Whatever set it off must be around here. I'm trying to get the, that uh, tech point before we leave. I'm excited for the new console, mostly PS5, for one reason. What's that? Wow, that was easy. Don't see anyone. Gonna check our next area. We're all clear over here. Let me see if I can. Oh, the half thick live feedback. Yeah, that does seem pretty cool. I don't know how like useful or like how much people actually like be into it, but I'm not like 100% like up to date with like what exactly it does either. I'll be honest, like. I don't know. It sounds neat, but I don't know if like that's something I would fully want as someone who like usually turns off like any type of feedback from controllers. Give me a drone and I can't hijack that one. I can hijack this one though. Where is this guy? That's right there. Yeah, call a cargo drone. What a demo they showed you walking toward a fan and the pressure of the fan gets bigger the more you walk to it. That's pretty, I mean, it's neat. It's just like, I don't know if it's really my thing. Like, I don't know. At the same time, I also haven't like kind of dealt with something like that before. So. I'm curious to see what like overall feedback of the hat haptic feedback is going to be when everyone has it like ah, the GBB. as a standard the world's greatest public i'm wondering whether like people are actually going cheap. to like it this or is not where you'll, find out big contract. you'll get bounced at the door i mean sure. i would try it at the least GBB for has sure access point on the roof. at Should least at one point it. i think it would be worth at least checking out but 
that's just how I feel about it. I don't know. Maybe it's like a uh, amazing thing. I've just never thought of it. <laughs> Could be. Oh, I'm being detected by who? I got the uh, the default helmet today, which is pretty neat. Or well, no, not today. I got it last night actually, but still, still pretty neat. I don't have it on this character right now though. Oh, oh God. Take it down, take it down. Go, 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 go. Plus they said if you have a bow on the trigger, it gets harder to pull. I did hear that. I saw like, I think it was somebody that might have got like early access. Is in your brain. Or um. Your love, your fear, your dreams, even the cheeky ones. Whatever it's uh, Are all electrical signals firing back and forth between your ears. West of us, this I think right it was. This right here is more powerful than any computer. But it has its limitations. I watched my mother succumb to motor neuron disease, and her loss made me realize that death comes to us all. But what if we could change that? Oh boy. What if this game's we could basically a giant and black mirror the neural episode? The cloud? <laughs> well, that would mean the end of human suffering, of death itself, and the beginning of a new society where war, oppression, disease are all worries of the past. Hello, my name is Sky Larson. I'm CEO of BrokerTech, and this is Daybreak. Project Daybreak. Now, since all of you have signed up for our waitlist, I'm sure you're eager to see how Daybreak really works. But before we do that, I'll ask the technicians at the board to cut the live feed. We wouldn't want any uninvited guests recording these trade secrets. Daybreak is an imaging system which scans the... Oh boy. They cut the feed. Get out of here. Go, go, go. Ah, be detected. Be quick about it. There you have it, dead sec. The big contract. You want to bring down Sky Larson? Oh, I want to do more than that. The problem is, Larson hasn't been seen in public in nearly two years. And he can't kill a hologram. I've been trying to track her down. I found a home here in London, but that, well. Larson's a genius. She revolutionized uh, AI. Legend. She Bagley, for fuck's sake. Have you figured out, or did sure? you unlock the Plenty. deep profile? But you need to see for yourself. A mansion's in Westminster. The things you'll see in there. She disconnected. Um. So, I figured this out last night. I thought when you deep profiled a member that, uh, so like this guy right here. Like right now I can do his mission, but then, uh, okay. So all these people, this guy, he doesn't like me. So in order to get them to like you, you have to deep profile them. Right. And then you run one of these, uh, recruitment missions. Well, I just figured out. And then after you do that, uh, you can run their mission and actually recruit them. It wasn't until last night about after playing all day long, that I realized that if you deep profile them again and do one of these, that is literally like 95% of the time faster than running their actual mission to recruit them. And you get some pretty interesting stuff through here as well. Um, so yeah, it took me forever to realize that, Bugly. but so basically so after you run that too, they're instantly recruited because they call you back and they're like, okay, you helped me out. I'll help you out now. Um, but hold on one sec. I'm going to run to the bathroom real quick and then we'll go ahead and continue. So, BRB.